Hey, I'm Larry Weikert of the Old Farts Racing Team. Hey, about 12, 13 years ago, we, uh, a bunch of us got together to sell some t-shirts. We had a, a logo with a guy doing a burnout in a chair. Uh, Ron Spear and Dave Barnico said, hey, let's do a little race team. About 20 of us got together, threw our 20 bucks in. Jimmy Dehart was part of that deal. 15. Number 15. I'm only number three. Uh, I'm behind a couple of them guys. Uh, anyway, uh, we, we thought it was 20 of us just going to have fun and ha-has, and uh, that was the old Rodco, Riverside, California. And uh, it turned into a deal where uh, people started coming down, barbecuing, more people coming down, barbecuing, a couple hundred, 300, 500. We got 1,700 members of Old Farts yeah, 12 years later. Uh, about 10 years ago, Gary Achito from uh, the Rotary came down and said, hey, you guys can, why don't you guys put a car show on for me? Uh, I'm from the Rotary, and we'll uh, do it downtown Riverside. We didn't know any better, so we, we, we went ahead and did it. He asked uh, Ron Spear, our old teacher from high school, to do this, and Ron had a lot of knowledge in doing uh, motocross events. So he, and, he got us all, all the old students to do it, because we were cheap, we were free. We got free t-shirts, and that's all we got. And uh, that was in 99. Uh, we said we were only going to do it for a couple years. For some reason, uh, 10 years later, we still have Show and Go, which is downtown Riverside. Um, Show and Go is, uh, we cruise a lot. We don't back up on the cruise route. Um, you know, our deal is we're hot rodders. We want the hot rodders to have a good time. So this year is our 10th anniversary. We figure we kick it up a little bit and uh, put a little concert in the park. Uh, we have White Park downtown Riverside. It's a bitchin' park. Uh, it's got a little gazebo. We get a bunch of hundred people in there, maybe a thousand, and we'll try to do some uh, bands all day. And then all of a sudden, the, this one guy uh, kind of been hanging around Riverside for a few years, a guy named Rod Piazza. We started bannering back and forth, and hey, uh, can we do this god dang deal in the park? Hey, okay, oh hey, we got this, that, back and forth. Finally, me and Harad come together on something. Said, hey. Why don't we do Rod Piazza? You'll be our headliner. Um, we'll put some cars in there, and uh, we'll have fun with the thing. So uh, this year we had Rod Piazza, the Mighty Flyers, a couple other bands in there. Uh, Gary Achito's brother was playing on a blues band. It was a good day all day. And uh, next year we're going we're gonna to kick it up a little notch. You know, We thought it was pretty bitching this year, but next year it's going to be cool. I mean, cool every year, so we're going to have fun. And our deal is, our motto is, if you ain't going to do it, don't do it unless you're having fun. And what I'm going to do now, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to ask Rod to say a few things. Uh, this is Rod Piazza, Mighty Flyers. <laughs> well, these cats got the right idea. They're doing it real. You know, they're keeping it real. And no uh, backing up on the cruise. Everybody's having a good time. Their cars ain't overheating. It ain't so crowded that you can't move around. And they got a lot of people here is really interested in the spirit of Riverside. We're playing the blues down here because we're all part of the same boat, right? Ain't that right? We're rocking in the same boat. And uh, uh, next year going to be a, a situation because the police going to have to come in because there are going to be so many people want to get down here that we don't know what to do with them. This is Tim Williams from the uh, Riverside East Rotary. Tim Williams is the president of the East Rotary. In Riverside, two years. In two years. He's coming up on uh, running the Riverside East Rotary in Riverside. Um, he's getting involved with show and go a little bit. No, I want, I'm on, now I want to let you know something, and I'm not going to tell you no lies, because everybody that know me know I don't lie. This cat right here came up with the heavy bread to put on this show and bring the blues back to Riverside. And we're going to be here next year, but we are moving it to downtown on the street. So if you want to get in, you have to come up with, like, what they have to get, a can of pork and beans or, or something like that. We're going to make it happen, baby, all because of this man right here, because he had the insight and the vision and the thought to carry these blues to the 21st century.